welcome to Gemstone Tarot. This is your daily tarot for Thursday, the 11th of October 2018. Now, do you want to sit on my knee, sweetheart? I don't think anybody wants to see that particular view of you. Not that kind of channel, Valentine. Okay. Oh, she's going to go and get settled on the bed, I think. Yes, we've got the old going on. Valentine has just been, well, I don't say rescued because she didn't need rescuing. She's just been removed from the kitchen surface. Ew! Don't really like it when she jumps on the kitchen surface. Where, my fault, I left the normal cat nuts, not the dreamies, which are the kind of cat drug nuts, but just the normal boring, you know, the ones from the vets. I left them and there she was with her head stuck in the bag and her ass in the air. She'd been in the house about three seconds. Yes. Don't want this to become a habit, Val. Mm. Okay. She's settled. Let's have a look. This is for Thursday, the 11th of October, 2018. I can't believe yesterday I said 2019 and you know I didn't even feel it. I try so hard. Dates for me, they almost feel like something trying to pop out. Like an unruly beast, you know, and I'm trying. That's the hardest part of the whole video is the date. And I sit there and I think, what's the day? What's the day? Say it, Gemma. Say it, Gemma. And then just now and again, something pops out. Usually, though, it's during Mercury retrograde. But I don't know about you. I found this particular Venus retrograde so far to be a bit troublesome. It's a bit tricky. As Blackadder used to say, you twist and turn like a twisty, turny thing. Yes. Ace of Wands in... Oh! <laughs> okay. All right, tarot cards. That's what you get <laughs> from mouthing off at the beginning of a video. Okay, let's get comfortable. <laughs> Ace of Wands in reverse. This is what I'm feeling in this Venus retrograde. I'm feeling the momentum of the retrograde a lot. Ace of Wands is a card of creative initiation. It's also the card of, as Marvin Gaye used to say, getting it on, okay? For obvious reasons. <laughs> right, it's in the reverse, people. It's in the reverse. Initiating passionate affairs when Venus is retrograde. Not usually the greatest idea, could be a lot of fun, but probably would be quite short lived. So if you're looking for a fling -a ling not so bad. If you're looking for something that's gonna last, or as Fergus Sharkey said, true love of a lasting kind, then it's good to kind of hold the reins on it a little bit. Just see if things can be held back for that six week period. If it's still there at the end of it, when you hurtle into Mercury retrograde, and you're still there at the end of that, let's say by Christmas, then you've got a keeper on your hands. And the same goes for creative endeavours. If you are the kind of person who needs to rush, you need to do it now, which most of us have a streak of that in us, again, it would do to hold off. For others of us, we are processing some kind of romantic or emotional disappointments. Five of Cups in reverse. Five of Cups, of course, always has those Two of Cups still upright, which becomes the Two of Cups. But it's not what we're focusing on. And also, in the Five of Cups, there is a ruin in the background and he is kind of looking down. He's not looking forward. It's not quite the time yet. To look forward. Looking forward would be the Ace of Wands in the upright. We also have the Page of Wands in the reverse. Again, Page of Wands is an energy that's almost a teenage energy of, yeah, let's do this thing, yeah, are you with me? No, let's do it anyway. But it's in reverse, which is a whoa. 
This whole reading has got whoa written all over it. The title is going to be Hold Your Horses. Now, Venus retrograde, and in fact, any kind of important retrograde, you tend to find you get the itch of what you should not scratch. So in other words, you shouldn't rush things. Can't hurry, love. <laughs> this is obviously the song edition, um, but you will want to. You will want to rush into things blindly. Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. You will be feeling that energy. Kind of looks like an owl when it's upside down, doesn't it? Wisdom. You'll be feeling that energy, but there's quite a lot more at stake than it feels because, you know, you've got your minor arcana, but then your aces are kind of upper level in importance. And we have an ace, but then we have a major arcana too the devil in the reverse okay he's in the reverse when you see the devil in a reading i mean it does vary from reading to reading but in this case it's about making sure if you are having a bit of an emotional clear out in one way or another about a specific person or just about how you love you know, what's your approach to life, to love, to yourself, to self-love, whatever kind of love. Because obviously love, I was thinking about this today while I was um, making myself an English breakfast, actually, this morning. I was thinking about agape, which is the Greek kind of version of love, I think. I should have looked that up before I came on, but I haven't. But I was thinking, more importantly, that different languages other than English have loads of different words for love. And that love is kind of just one thing, but has lots of different guises. So whichever way you're loving or thinking of loving or revising your modus operandi or your heart chakra or your behaviour or whatever aspect it is, know that it runs quite deep. And that's what retrogrades are for. They come in to dig deep in a certain backwards facing area. <laughs> that sounds really rude. <laughs> oh, Gemma. But you know what I'm saying, okay? I hope. Oh, Valentine. Valentine flashing at the beginning is where it all went downhill. Look at that, people. Clean it up. And what do we say about this card? You can only clean your side of the street, but you certainly are. It's like a bit of an emotional, um, I would say spring cleaning, of course that depends whereabouts in the world you are. I think in Australia, are you in spring? I think you are, you're just about to start spring, aren't you, in the other side of the world? Of course we're just about to start autumn, well we're, we're in autumn, although it's 20 degrees here today and really sunny. It's absolutely glorious actually. Amen to that. And Amen to that. I love this card. It's been a while, baby, since we had miracles. Never gets old for me. Never gets old. Keep on keeping on, folks, with what you're doing because you're doing good, okay? Leave me a comment, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you tomorrow. Namaste.